Hi all, today I just want to run a quick fall rate experiment with you um, to show you how different fall rates um, can apply to different size jigs. So what I've got here is I've got some 3.5s, a Gancraft and some Breedens and a 3.0 Yamashita. I've got some 3.5 Deeps, I've got some 4.0s here uh, in a, a shallow fall, a standard Gancraft, um, a Deep Breeden. 4.5 Monster, some 3.0s there, and a Shimano 2.5. So the first experiment I want to do is probably just show you how a normal Gangcraft 3.5 falls against a Breeden 3.5 Shallow. So drop them both into the water. Big difference in the fall rate. So next experiment, let's grab the 2.5 Shimano, let's get that falling up against the Breeden, drop them both in, 2.5 falls a lot sharper, now what we'll do is I'll grab what's known as a soft fall up against the standard so I think there's only one gram difference between a shallow and a soft fall but have a look at the difference in how it falls okay still slower than the Gangcraft but obviously not as slow as the shallow even though there's only one gram difference. So let's do the same now with a free fall and a standard Gangcraft. Got them in. Pretty much identical. So when you're talking about a breed and free fall, that's probably the same as a standard Gangcraft 3.5. Next experiment, what we'll do is I'll grab shallow 4.0 up against a 3.5 Gangcraft. 3.5 falls quicker. Next experiment, I'll grab just a standard 4.0 Gangcraft up against the 4.0 breeding. Gangcraft falls quicker. And that, let's say one second or one and a half or two seconds can make a big difference in being able to land a fish or not. But if you need it to fall quicker because you're fishing really deep water and strong current and um, sometimes you chuck in a jig and it's just getting sort of swept away and not even getting close to the bottom. This is a 4.0 deep up against a standard Gangcraft 4.0. Deep falls a lot sharper. Last experiment. Let's grab a Monster, 4.5 Monster up against a standard 4.0 Gangcraft. Ooh, I'd say the Gangcraft fell a little bit quicker. A little bit quicker. So that is an absolute ripper. If you want to fish a big jig in an area um, and not get snagged because it's falling just as slow as your 4.0, definitely that would be your go. Now let's just do a standard Gangcraft 3.0 up against a free fall 3.0 breeding. Identical. So when you're matching a, a standard jig with a breeding jig, your free falls are pretty much um, identical, especially in the, the Gangcraft range. Um, so that's just a little bit of a tip on how these different jigs can have different fall rates. Thanks for watching.